Hi everyone and welcome back to today's video. Now as you may notice I have got absolutely no foundation all around here. I've just done a liquid lipstick review and if you've seen it already maybe it's not up yet I don't know but if you have seen it already you'll understand what I mean. If not oh my god wiping off that stuff it went everywhere it really did I had a face full of pink lips <laughs> pink lipstick <laughs> anyway <laughs> face full of pink lips would be a bit odd <laughs> anyway I have got to sort this skincare out so today is a lifestyle video and I'm going to organize this it's such a mess. I've been throwing stuff in there randomly. There's some old stuff in there I need to get rid of. And I want to fit some bits in there. I want to fit this uh, shelf gel set from Mum. What she bought me. And also fit in this skincare set from Julie. And there's a bunch of stuff over here to fit in there as well. If I can. There is a lot of products. Believe me. There's a ton. So anyway, let's get into this. So the first product which I will be keeping, it looks disgusting in the lid, is my shave gel. This is just the Aldi regular sensitive skin shave gel. I am keeping that because I use it regular. Now I have this in here, the Vaseline Spray and Go Body Moisturiser. It's got barely anything in it. I have had this for years so that has got to go. I really like those, so by the way, if you like a spray moisturiser instead of cream. Now, I bought this some months back, the Liqueura Body Lotion, which is the pure cocoa butter. I've not used it yet. I want to pick up the Vaseline one to this to do a dupe it video. I've just not got round to doing that, and so I'm keeping that. I have my goodness. I'm using that one. This is a whole pack of razors I pick up from Aldi. Four disposable razors and a three bladed and you know razors. What more can you say? We all know what to do. And they're staying because I've not had them that long. It's tearing even. I'm molting everywhere. So this is a Beauty Formless Activated Charcoal Cleansing Wash. And this was in my project pan. And then I found the uh, Bior one, which is in the bathroom. And I started using that. And then I did go back to this. Oh, I like this one, but not as much as that one. So I'm going to let this go. Another product I have is just a regular hand wash, which is from Lidl. And I just use this to wash my brushes when, when I can be bothered to do them. <laughs> so I'm going to keep that because it does do a good job. I still have this because I found another use for it, which was to shave under my armpits with this. It works for that. I won't use it on my legs because they're too sensitive to have anything scented on them and also i use a electric razor so i don't need it there so this is just a shower mousse passion fruit and jasmine i don't like it as a shower mousse as a shave gel it's absolutely fine i'm pretty sure somewhere it said it could be used for that but i have no clue where it is the next product is this argan oil hair treatment which I've had for a long time but it's still okay and I've used a lot of it although it's only down to there I really like this it's really nice I use it on towel dried hair and it's just a really nice product it really is so if you can pick one of these up they have them in B&M and I believe they have them in the pound shop as well so I picked this up, I think this was £1.25 with the pump because it used to come with just a pour bottle. Don't know why I did that. Um, and now it's got a pump on, so it's a little bit more, but you know, it's worth it. Keeping that. 
Now, I know I'm going to be getting rid of this. This is the Advanced Techniques by Avon, the Daily Shine, Mirror Shine Spray. I just don't use it. I really don't. I have had this for so long. If you're familiar with Avon products, you'll probably say that's an old packaging. And you'll be right. So that's going to go. Another item I'm going to be getting shot of because actually the looks of it, it's gone. Oh yeah. It, oh no, actually, no, it's not that. I thought these were bath salts, you see. A body scrub. Actually, it is a body scrub. What am I doing? Smelled okay. Yeah, it is the actual body scrub that's supposed to be in there. I don't think that looks very good anymore. I've had it for such a long time that it's even dusty. So I'm going to be getting rid of that. I don't tend to use body scrubs. It's not something I use. Another product I am going to probably get rid of. I'm not quite sure, actually. And this is the Lecura Active Linen 48-hour Roll-On Deodorant. Now, I might pick up the sure one because I'm pretty certain this is what it's duping. But to be fair with you, I don't like roll-ons that much. I prefer a spray. So, to be fair, I will never use that. So, I'm going to get rid of it. For some reason, I have this tub. Oh, I remember. It was... Oh, wow. Oh, my God, that looks disgusting. It's a scrub I got in that sachet what I picked up from Feel Unique. It's a sample, and I popped it in there, and now it looks like that. So, that's going to go. I don't use body scrubs. I don't know why I picked it up. I still have those bath bombs, which I'm still intending to use in a foot bath, so they're staying. I have this scrubby thing and what the idea is you put your fingers in there and you use it to scrub your brushes, clean your brushes. Now I picked this up from the pound shop a good few years ago and it is actually really decent, really nice but what I found with it is by the time you've done a few brushes the water seeped in, it's all wet and squidgy, you have to take the fingers out, dry the product and start again. And that's the reason why I bought a different makeup brush cleaner, which you would have saw in my brush cleaning video. So, I'm going to let that go now. That's going to go. It was a pound, it's done its purpose. I have another hand wash. Uh, always good to have it's a bit runny to be fair but it's always good to have so I shall keep that it's more of a refill bottle thing I have got a pump on another bottle I'm sure it'll fit that one of them will that'll stay I have this antibacterial intense foot cream from Newton's. This is my second tube of this. I really like it. I highly recommend it. And that's staying. I have this here. I picked this up from uh, Aldi Pound or something. I wanted to try this fabulous stuff. The stuff you spray down the toilet before you go to the toilet, if you know what I mean. Fabulosa it's from does it work no it doesn't work it does nothing so that's going I'm not keeping stuff it's literally rubbish I have a moisturizer here a little sample size from Cetaphil or Cetaphil and it's old so that's going to go I have oh. I have some little perfume oils, which Neil detests. <laughs> and they're from high-end brands. And that one smells okay, to be fair, in my opinion. Um, oh, I love that one. I just don't really wear them, though. It's just something I don't wear, mainly because you don't like them. He finds them a bit too strong. I must admit, they are a little bit on the overpowering side. That's a Chanel number no. 5. 
That's Poison by who? I can't remember. And this one, I took the uh, label off to see where it was in the bottle. And that's by Chivage. As I know, that is how you pronounce it. And not Givenchy, which is what I used to say. And they do smell fine. But I know that's discoloured. And I think that's just because of the oil. Um... Yeah, I still really like these, uh, although they're old, and maybe this should go. But, oh, you know, I'm going to keep hold of them until the next time I do this box, and we'll see where we go from there. Um, oh, that's got watery. An empty-ish bottle of the Candy Hearts Liqueur Cleansing Hand Gel, which can now go because it looks like it's seen better days. I also have this, look, well, it's a covered in dust. I need to wipe these over and clean that box before I put anything else in. I might make this a two-parter, to be honest. Um, this is a skin therapy from Wilco, and it's a tea tree gentle facial scrub. I like it, though. I really do like it, but I have had this for such a long time. However... Let's take that lid off if it comes off. Yep. It actually, oh gosh, dried there. Don't actually smell it anymore. You know what? I'm going to let it go. I am, because I've actually broken that now. <laughs> yeah, I'm letting that go. No, it's been there too long. Um, I still have this. Oh, the shampoo. Um, I just don't like them. But I'm going to use the last one. I will make the effort to use the last one. Now, the reason why I've got a part of a sample of shampoo open is because, one, I didn't need all that sachet, and two, this is revolting. I do not like it. I don't like the smell of it. It's a smell I find offensive. Um, so that's going because I will never use it. And um, I have some pouches here from some jewellery I had. And so I'll so pop them somewhere else, not into the skincare. I also have this sort of cream skincare in a tube. I like this for when you get spots. Dab a bit of that on, leave it on for hours, and it does sort them out. It really does. It helps a lot. So I'm keeping that. I have an empty tub here, or do I? Oh, no, I've got some mask in here, which looks like it's seen better days. Um, Yeah, um, it's oily. I think it's separated. That's going to go. And, yeah, I kept this little tiny drop a bottle because I thought it was too cute I know I'm still keeping it <laughs> I find something that goes in there you know <laughs> that's what she said right I've got this bath essence we don't have baths we have shower we don't have any bath so it seems a bit pointless but I could give this to my mum Although she can't get into the bath at the minute because it's upstairs. And although she's got help to get in and out of the bath and the carers are there. Her stairs are so steep. I mean, they are scary. So, I understand they're not tempting it. And I'm glad she doesn't. So, at the moment, this won't be any good to her. I'll either use this for in the foot soak. Or just use it as a shower gel. Because it smells perfectly fine and it's really nice and it's sandalwood and patchouli and I love those fragrances. So I'm going to keep it. So what I'm going to do now, oh, one more product, is just a Nivea lip balm in the rose one. And it's a full one, not being used yet. I'm coming to the end of my current one. So I'm going to pop this over there ready. So... 
I'm going to clean this box and mm, I've got so much skincare to go in here it's going to be another half an hour I'll tell you what I'm going to do I'm going to leave this video here as part one and I'll be back with you next time as a part two so please do all the good stuff everyone it really does help out my channel please consider subscribing and pressing the notification bell to all so you'll know when I upload new content I'm going to see you next time take care everyone goodbye